Malix McBlad here with a special video. I'm gonna have some fun with this one because it was a pro match. I'm telling you right now, I am going to lose, but this is such a special video because I played against Captain Awesome and lived to tell the tale. I played against the Hunchback of Notre Pain and lived to tell the tale. And I played against Rainey's, well, Rainey was a heliquin, but still I played against Rainey as a pro and I lived to tell the tale and I want to tell you all about it. It was a great match. I'm going to go Deadly Gun, and I'm going to use Strong Charge, but I'm going to use it for defense. But really quickly, let me show you my challenges. Oh, hey, look at that. I never used uh, never used Sprint Boost Your once in my life. All right. Now, immediately get up targets. on that roof. It's important to get up on that roof when the match starts. Cars. Like all pros, I said at the beginning of my Pienza video, all, all champions get up on that roof immediately. Uh, immediately, though, I thought Squidish was a pro. What the hell is this, incognito drop kill garbage? You want to be a pro, you get that shot off right before Rainy. As soon as Rainy starts aiming, you just aim and fire that gun. That's the way you do it. I'm going to fail a little bit here. I'm telling you guys, I, this is, I usually don't do the pro stuff. I'm trying it out here. I'm going to get a little better. At, uh, I think I show some promise in this match. But uh, immediately, I should have stayed up on that rooftop right where I was instead of uh, running down. Should also be using Wall Runner as a, as a perk and using Silent Hunt because champions use Silent Hunt in wanted matches. I don't know if you guys knew that. Uh, if you're a real true pro champion, you use Silent Hunt and you can run at people and uh, it works out really well. So I'm using Silent Hunt, but uh, I end up using overall cooldowns, which was a mistake. One minute in, I have 100 points. I'm not worried about it. I'm even going to run up things I can't run up. I'm so not worried about it. But the whole point is I'm immediately trying to run up things. Uh, I'm going to screw up terribly right here people like like i said before people like seeing screw-ups you're gonna see it right here if i really wanted this match if i'm trying to be a pro and i gotta commit to it i should be running full speed none of this half-hearted garbage trying to chase him down maybe this is exactly what happens <laughs> you see captain awesome just bolting oh, yeah. and wow. taking out <laughs> that beard beard uh but however I, I do show a little bit more promise right here just immediately as soon as you have that gun ready forget about walking up to him keep incognito I should have gotten the midair right here. It didn't, didn't necessarily at work. Uh, but, achievement unlocked. Lord Cromdor 53. Because yep, I, I don't know if you guys ever get random things happening like that. Like a friend pops up. Immediately you're like, what achievement did I just unlock? I unlocked the get killed by Rainy for 300 points achievement. Two minutes in, 200 points. I'm doing pretty well as far as being a pro is concerned. I'm doing okay. I screwed up terribly. Should have jumped on that chase breaker immediately. And uh, here's the other reason why I'm not going to be too pro, although it's a great way to go. I'm going to use charge on defense. I don't know. Get me that one guaranteed stun, provided I'm looking the right way. But if I go the other way, I feel like a real noob and feel terrible about myself. I am not good enough to get a drop kill on, uh, on Squidish. What I am able to do is just punch him in the head as he tries to run by. That counts. Silent kill. Uh, not necessarily good enough, because I know we're supposed to be, you know, if you're, if you're holding right trigger down the whole time should never really be getting silent kills with that said gotta stay up on that roof as much as possible i think i think we know that from watching captain awesome and uh and watching a hunchback and notre pain videos i'm uh gonna do a reasonable job of staying up on that roof i'm gonna chase down i heard those whispers just running away at this point holding down that right trigger as much as possible trying to figure out the uh, the quickest way to get to my target which once again is, is Rainy, which is which is always nice. Anytime you get a chance to murder Rainy and live to tell the tale, that's that's always good. Uh, should have taken one more step out onto that ledge and gotten an acrobatic kill. I, I really should have. That that was definitely a mistake, but I still get the revenge, so it's not so bad necessarily. Uh, this this is going pretty well so far. Now now I'm getting to the idea of just continuing to run. Uh, the second I had my target, even though she was on the ground, I go up to the air, which is I think the way it's supposed to be played. Uh, yeah, you guys will see uh, eventually after uh, immediately or initially targeting the wrong person I'm going to uh, I'm going to hear those gunshots and uh, or hear the sound of, of getting locked on Just jump down entirely and uh, I'm able to cut her off get that three kill streak Which is so important get that plus 100 bonus you you need that three that, that plus 100 bonus If you're gonna if you're gonna compete in a match like this. I avoided gunfire. I'm happy. I just ran for my life uh, pretty garbage tactic what I'm about to do. This is not appropriate considering the people we're playing against and the level of proness that's going on right now. I'm gonna use charge for an escape. That's kind of puss tactics. Not not really all that imp uh, impressive. But uh, you guys want to talk about impressive? You get another shot, uh, another chance to to shoot that that hunchback. You have taken you, the you, lead. You take what you can get. Midair bonus, variety bonus. Finally got that midair. 
Uh, if you're going to try an aim, I recommend always going for the midair. Uh, if you're, you're going to be using the gun. Uh, little known fact, I only used the gun once in my life up until this point. Up until I started doing these matches. Um, rainy... No, duck! Shots fired! There's nothing I can do! She just immediately shot. And, uh, yeah. Ah, uh, what are you going to do? Uh, only time I'd used the gun ever once in my life was to get the extreme variety for getting the one shot, one mid-air kill, one achievement. So I am used to the uh, the shot fired and, and getting the achievement popping up. It isn't just the Lord Cromdor that popped up when I'm, I'm used to firing the gun. You gotta chase down Squiddish. Must chase down Squiddish. It's, it's my new goal in life. It's uh, pretty much any time I get that target. Damn it, Wall Runner! Be better and get Wall Runner. Don't use overall cooldowns. Ah, uh, so frustrated with myself. But I will make up for it. I swear, I have to make up for it. I am going to chase down that man. I'm doing such a good job of angling and staying locked on and uh, slowly cutting to him on the roofs. I'm so proud of myself and I'm using that silent hunt like all champions. If you keep using silent hunt when you finally run after him, you're going to be able to catch him. No! <laughs> I knew that was coming and I still get annoyed every time I see it. Uh, I, if you guys notice, he blinded me. This wasn't the first time he blinded me with firecrackers when I started chasing him. Uh, second I run after him, he threw the firecrackers. That time I just stood alone on the roof. I just stood there, feeling sad and pathetic that I had failed again in trying to grab him and got blinded by those firecrackers. Uh, it's great, because I know it's coming and it still abuses the hell out of me. So hopefully you guys got some pleasure out of that. Um, I am so pro though. Quick scope, headshot, immediate death. I don't even have to aim, just die by my hand, and uh, I, I like it, but immediately Squidish gets that lead back, that bastard Squidish with that lead getting back. <laughs> uh, do a uh, do a terrible job right here. Had I just stood exactly where I was, the doctor would have walked right to me. Instead, I decide to run away and try and go up another roof, because pros go on higher rooftops, and I miss out entirely. Uh, hopefully I end up catching him. I don't know, I'm too busy getting chased by someone else, so my, my new goal is to <laughs> charge off the edge of the roof, because I figured why not. Uh, this is going to be an epic fail right here. I'm going to get the escape, but if you're a champion, you get escapes by keeping running. You don't stand still for a couple of seconds. That's just disappointment right there. That's not the way to go about it. Uh, I did get the escape, though, so I can't really complain too much. If you really want to see how to escape people, you just run this way. And, uh, you know, do pretty pretty reasonable job of running away, away from people right now. And uh, if you're using Silent Hunt, you can run up that doctor. That still counted as a silent kill with Silent Hunt. So that's why I, I had that equipped, because Champions and Wanted use Silent Hunt. I don't know if you guys knew that, but if you're a Champion and Wanted, you should be using Silent Hunt for your perks. This is going to be... Uh, this is where I think I show a little bit of, uh, a little bit of uh, potential in future. I mean, I'm going to end up losing this match at, at being a pro. But uh, I'm going to show some potential at, uh, at being being able to do it. Had I stood right where I was, Shenmue, Captain Awesome, would have come right up to me. Instead, I'm going to keep incognito this entire time and then run him down. And from a foot away, you just wait for him to jump and you get that murder <laughs> with the gun. I think I show some potential. I think if I can show less patience in the future, just, you know, hold that right trigger down a little bit more, not, not be as pensive... I think I could show uh, show some promise and actually be a pretty good pro at some point. I, I show a little bit of promise, uh, but but ultimately, as you guys will see, I, I really uh, I really didn't have it. It's 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 more of a skill that uh, that needs to be acquired through many hours of trying to get this playstyle. Uh, right now, I'm just uh, hanging out on those rooftops uh, really badly, want to get towards Squidish, and uh, this is totally cheating on my part if you just stand there and wait for him to walk up to you. That's not pro. That's, that's kind of garbage. Um, uh, at this point, uh, I, you know, about, about a minute and a half to go, a minute 25 to go, since I do this commentary after the fact, I may as well get the time correct. Uh, you guys will see, I just really badly want to get to that doctor. It's all, it's all I want in life, but if you get hit by throwing knives, you know that Captain Awesome is about to murder you, and terrible things are going to happen. Second you get hit by throwing knives, you know Captain Awesome is coming. There's very little that can be done, but uh, like I said, I did live to tell the tale uh, in the end. It, wasn't, it didn't end up being that bad. The match uh, I end up the match with uh, 3,800 points, and I get 12 kills. Which is not, it's not, uh, that's not acceptable. Uh, I can tell you guys, or, you know, I, I, won't, I won't ruin it. Actually, I'll, I'll, I'll wait another couple of seconds. See, I just got my 20th kill with a gun. And the barber who ended up joining late probably could have walked up to me and gotten an incognito kill. But it looks like he was joining and playing pro as well. 
So you got to appreciate that the barber is going to do that too. It's, a, it's, it's very nice. Um, just a couple of things that I want to improve on when I end up remaining. doing pro videos in the future. Uh, I think I'm probably, as much as I like using charge to get the studs, because it's awesome as long as you're pointed in the right direction, get that guaranteed kill. Uh, things I want to do, I, I definitely included wall runner in, a, in new future builds. You have to get that wall runner. And I'm about to get killed, but at least I, I was able to get that one half slice before I got shot, but it still counted for me, so I will take it. Uh, with time running out, gotta use wall runner, uh, and I'm thinking maybe try sprint boost, because as I showed, I have no no uh, uh, progress whatsoever with any sprint boost first. challenges. Uh, I will finish the match first, but as I said, I fail at being pro. The victory goes to Shenmue with 12 kills. Technically, if, you, if you're in a pro match, the, the winner is the person who has the most uh, most kills. But if you're tied, the person who has the lowest points and the most kills wins. So congrats to Shenmue, and congrats to you guys for watching this video. Thanks again, and subscribe and stuff. Thanks.